What a night. You mean what a mess. Is it time for bed? It's 4 a.m. We're on our way to the yacht enthusiast party. It's gonna be so fun. We're not there to have fun. You're not there to have fun. I bet you there's gonna be lots of cute preppy boys. You mean stuck up jerks? Your taste in boys is actually the worst. Remember that guy last semester? Guys, guys, stop. We're on our way to the party now, which shouldn't go too horribly if Bess and George actually cooperate. Hey. It's almost midnight. I think we spent too much time at Bess's friend's house. And then we ended up on the wrong part of the street and we are walking in circles. Location services have completely failed us tonight. Oh, that must be their house. 12.15 PM. Isabella was at the door and let Bess and George inside, but wouldn't let me in. Something about nosy blondes. Then she said that I could get in for $15 because attending our party is an honor. Bess and George are gonna let me in. Or I might try and climb in through a window or something. They're taking a while. I crawled in through a window on the bottom floor. Bess was distracted and talking to a group of boys, obviously, and I haven't seen George yet. I have to explore the rest of the house and figure out where Crowley's stuff could be. Maybe in the basement or a closet. It's already after midnight and if I can't find anything tonight, well, I don't have any other options. I almost ran into Ada downstairs. I don't have time to deal with that. <laughs> Sugar, it's locked. Crowley's things have to be somewhere. Nancy, come dance with me. Oh, Bess, I can't. I, I don't have time with the case. I know, but it'll be fun. There's this group of really cute boys on the lacrosse team. They call themselves the Hardy Boys. Isn't that adorable? I don't have time for this. Uh, stop being so tight. I'm not uptight. I bet the documents are on here. I'm gonna call Bess so we can hide the laptop in her bag and get out of here. Ow. Shut up! Oh, okay. Those guys locked me in here when they took the laptop, and I, I twisted my ankle when they pushed me down, and no one's hearing me knocking on the door, and Bess and George aren't answering their phones. Nancy Drew, what are you doing here? Hello, Ada. Isabella. Why are we still recording? She needs to document the disaster of tonight. That's just it. It wasn't a disaster. 